we're gonna be making Mnige by Tyler ICU on Elfo Studio Mobile. Yo, what's up? It's your boy Ambitious Kid, and in today's video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to make Nigga by Tyler ICU right here on Apple Studio Mobile. And guys, the good news is that I'm going to be giving away this hot Tyler ICU project file to you guys for free. Yes, guys, absolutely for free. But guys, before you download this hot project file, make sure that you subscribe and watch this video carefully because in this video, I'm going to be giving you guys the unlock password for this hot project file. Okay guys, let's get right into today's tutorial. Okay guys, so this is how I made the Tyler ICU beat inside FL Studio Mobile. So what I started with were the percussions and this is how my percussion started guys. Nice and simple. And guys, this is how my percussions look like inside the edit section. Super cool guys. So this is how they look like and this is how I place them. And guys, these percussions move at the speed BPM of 113. So there they are right there as you can see them. Okay guys, moving on to my next instrument is my angel voice and then let me solo it so you guys can hear it and it sounds as smooth as that guys. This is my angel voice and then guys, I doubled my angel voice using this sound and that sound. So all in all, they can sound super crispy guys. Okay guys, let me get out of here and then we can go to the next instrument which is the hot purity string and it sounds like this super hot guys and then what i did to my purity strings guys is that i tripled them in the edit section as you can see i used the c5 the c4 and this middle note so they can sound super cool guys and guys the reason why i tripled my strings is because let me quickly delete these two ones and then as you can hear them one string doesn't sound as cool as three strings guys so the more strings you place the better you know become good guys so that's why i tripled my strings hope you guys have learned about that one so guys i'm gonna click x and i'm gonna move on to my next instrument which is the drum five which i have my hi-hats and all the good stuff so this is how they sound like they really make the beat to become alive guys as you can hear it so this is how my hi-hats are i use this hi-hat this one I usually switched it off because I didn't need it. It sounded like this. So I'm going to switch that off. And then I used a kick here, down here. Then it all sounds like this, guys. Super nice and hard, guys. Okay, guys, we're going to get out by pressing X. And then we're going to find in our another instrument. So which my other instruments are my chords, the VCF chords. So this is how they sound like. They are super cool guys. Super hot guys. That's how I did my chords. And then guys to spice up the beat a little bit. I'm going to duplicate this part. And then I'm going to say copy. And then we're going to paste it up front right there guys let me paste it 
okay guys so that when i play the beat so it can also play along because it's at the back so this is how they all sound like guys with the chords and all the good stuff guys nicely done guys so my next instrument guys is the 808 bass to boost on my shorts and then this is how my 808 sounds like let me quickly turn it on by pressing solo as you can hear the strong bass coming from the 808 super hot guys so that's the job that the 808 does it's it boosts your chords or other instruments that are falling back behind it so something like this super hot guys moving on to my next instrument i had that i have the dot tylers which i named them that myself because i had to make them and then put them here because i didn't know which instrument they really used and they sound like this guys super cool guys and what i actually did to my dot tyler so they can sound really nice is that at this side guys when you press this middle triangle thing it's gonna show you these options so i added a reverb here as you can see and i also added a trans delay so it can delay my thing just like that guys so that's how i really made it super cool guys hope you guys have learned on how i made this thing to become this hot so guys we're gonna move on to my next instrument which i have the lead trumps which they sound like this which you won't really hear them properly they sound like this just like that guys that's their job nicely done guys so that's how i did the beat for this so now guys moving on to the most exciting parts the 808s and all the good stuff and the lock drums so this is how i did this hot 808 but you have to switch off this 808 and this chart so that it can add up so in the edit level guys this is how it looks like nice and simple guys and then this is how it sounds like alone nice 808 though guys so they use an 808 here guys so that they can make that nice quantum sound bass so guys if you want to make a quantum sound beat you gotta use an 808 that's the tip and trick i'm gonna give you guys today for a lot of people who don't know that so guys let's quickly move on to our next instrument my next instrument guys are the 808 heads which sound like this and then this is how they sound like guys super cool guys and hot so guys that's how i did my 808 heads to move along with my real 808 so that's why they are called the 808 heads because they move along with the real 808 nicely done guys so moving on to my next instrument i have my drums which sound like this super cool guys so in the drum section i put it the vocals the tyler icu important vocals which the first one sounds like this and then the second one sounds like this all in all they sound like this guys super cool guys so that's how i used my vocals so that they can add up and become super hot like this guys so moving on to my next instrument i have the drum steady and then inside the drum steady i have my heads and my bongo pa which sounds like this nice and smooth guys 
okay guys i'm gonna press the x button and we're gonna move on and explore some other instruments so my next instrument after this guys is the drum 31 which sounds like this super hot guys there are my snares obviously and then they're super simple guys i put it here nice and hot guys and the other instrument guys that when the bass plays it needs to be there it's the ghost pad which sounds like this and guys this is how the ghost pad sounds like which is the mostly important part of this beat too guys because Tylaisi uses it a lot the ghost pad guys so that's the mostly important part too when the bass play is playing so we cannot miss that one okay guys moving on to my next instrument after the ghost pad i have my we gotta go back now and then i have my lock drum and then this is how my first lock drum sounds like with the whole beat And it sounds like this and then let me quickly play it for you guys nicely done guys that's how my first lock drum sounds like and then I boosted my second my first lock drum with the 808 which Tyler ICU uses this 808 and then it's gonna sound super cool now guys just listen to this super hot guys that was fire so that's how i did my log drums by using the original log drum which was the first and using an 808 bass to spice up the lock drum and make it hit hard guys so that's how i did my lock drums for tyler icu and then guys moving on to my third lock drum i have the lock seven which sounds like this it's super hot too guys and then this is how it sounds like when you mix it with the lock drum super hot guys that spices things up really good guys so now guys we are moving on to my pattern 2 of my lock drums which makes things even more insane guys so moving on here guys i did this incredible style that tyler i see you actually included in his beat just like that guys let me quickly show you guys what i did And guys this is how i did it as you can see here let me put this there as you can see i changed the pattern here and guys to do that cool lock drum effect that plays here this is how i did it guys i used an 808 and then took the highest notes of the 808 here mixing it with the lock drum original notes it will sound super cool guys it will sound something like this which tell i see you did just like that guys that's how i made my lock drums moving on to my other instruments guys i have inside here i have the climple i have this head and i have this climple again guys all in all it sounds like this Cool climples guys, they actually boost up the beat and make it even realer guys cause Tyler ICU uses it as a cause Tyler ICU 
uses a lot of trimples in his piece so that's super cool guys so moving on to my next instrument guys and the last instrument i got my uplifter it's called the uplifter favorite and then it sounds like this let me quickly play it for you guys it mixes things up super hot guys so that's my last instrument the super uplifter as you heard right there guys thank you so much for watching this hot tutorial guys hope you guys have enjoyed learned a lot make sure to leave a comment and please don't forget to subscribe and guys make sure that you subscribe and leave a like on this video so that you cannot miss out on another hot tutorial like this one next time guys because i'll be releasing the dopest tutorials like never before guys and please leave a comment down below if you guys want me to make something cool and different maybe I